We're going to make a turn back to Europe now just very quickly and bring in Chad Thomas, our Berlin bureau chief on the news, that Wolfgang Schäuble, the German finance minister, is said to be ready to leave the finance ministry to lead the Bundestag. Just uh, walk us through what we've learned, Chad. Yeah, John, well, we're, we've learned this just really in the last uh, five to ten minutes from party officials that uh, Wolfgang Schäuble uh, is ready to step in to lead the Bundestag and, and then step away, of course, from the finance ministry. This is happening in part because of the reaction to the uh, right wing AFD getting into parliament in uh, the elections on Sunday. There's been a lot of discussion in Germany what that will mean for the operations of the parliament. And uh, there's been discussion then among senior uh, government officials that they wanted someone who was very senior to be in that position mm -hmm. running uh, the, the show, if you will, in the lower house of parliament, in the Bundestag. And we're now learning from sources that uh, Wolfgang Schäuble, the finance minister, is uh, indicating that he's willing to step in and take that role. He, of course, is the longest serving member of the German parliament and certainly is considered an elder statesman here in politics in Europe. Chad, there's two perspectives, of course. There's the domestic perspective, which, of course, they wanted a statesman in that position. And in Wolfgang Schäuble, they've most definitely got one if he does secure that role. But for the region, regionally speaking, they'll be looking at the German finance ministry and wondering what replaces the face of fiscal conservatism in Europe. Is that going to change? How does the coalition talks influence who takes that spot? Well, that really is the question here. And, and, and with uh, Wolfgang Schäuble stepping aside, that possibly opens up the finance ministry for uh, one of the potential coalition partners uh, that uh, Chancellor Merkel is speaking to. Of course, we don't know who will get that role. And, and really, it's a question if they end up going ahead with uh, a coalition that includes the Greens and also the Free Democrats. Uh, if you had the Greens running the finance ministry, that's a very different scenario than if it's the Free Democrats. So what it means for broader Europe is really uh, difficult to say at this point because we, of course, don't know who would actually be stepping into that role. And it could be uh, a very different direction depending upon who ends up with that uh, position. But it definitely gives Chancellor Merkel some uh, breathing room, if you will, if this, in fact, does play out in terms of being able to potentially offer the finance ministry to uh, coalition partners she's trying to woo.